What's up guys? We are here. We're about to head out to the Everglades. I'm gonna take Mitsuki, giving her the real Florida experience. We're here with Donnie again. I don't know if you remember him from our frogging video, but super amazing guy and he's gonna take us out, go for a good time. We might even do some fish gigging. So let's try it out. All right, we're gonna load up and head out. frogging for the first time she went um, once the last time recently right yeah. and it's been windy and we canceled on the fishing trip this time but instead we we're catching frog yep yeah. so unfortunately the winds picked up so we weren't able to go spearfishing today so I called my friend Donnie so nice to take us out frogging so well she is so nice to talk to Donnie so that I can do some kind of catch and cook <laughs> even though it's windy out here yeah so, so thank you so much you're thank welcome. you to you thank you to everybody well thank you donnie <laughs> let's see what we can get let's do it all right guys i didn't get to show you guys this last time but these are the frog gigs Hatch, look at that down. Right and they're super yeah, super long there. so you can Where have you some can. reach so you can smack them the sun is setting so we're going to launch this airboat and head out into the everglades I know we're gonna have so much fun, but we really have to be careful out here. The Everglades is a huge subtropical wetland ecosystem located here in Florida. It's often referred to as a river of grass because it's a giant slow moving river that's so wide you can't see the other side. Oh, wow. Wow. It goes to the aquifer, it keeps it clean. That's why this land can never be developed. Mm -hmm. And at any given time, it can hold up to three feet of water or be bone dry. Right now we're hitting a dry season. One thing you'll see tonight is a lot of alligators. It'll be a little more aggressive than normal because wow. it's mating season. They lay their eggs in June and at the end of July or August, you'll have the little babies. The babies are Animals. great. Is there any invasive species that There's we should be aware of? There's lots of invasive species that we got to hear. This is where the pythons are. Pythons. That aren't native to this. Okay. We uh, have a couple of guys that hunt them. Wow. They have dogs that attract them. And yes. a peacock bass. Peacock like. bass. There's every kind of cichlid that uh -huh. isn't native to here that have made their way to the Everglades. Those out here, they hunt them down south of here off of the uh -huh. uh, east-west trail of Holiday Park. If you go on the north side, you will see native white-tailed deer. Wow. And stuff nice. out here in the glades. Airboats are by far the best way to explore the Everglades. With their huge propellers, these flat-bottom boats skim the water's surface, allowing us to glide across the sawgrass prairies and hidden waterways. Airboats are designed to operate in very shallow water, as little as two to four inches deep. Hilarious. <laughs> you guys, we're legit. We, we got the fire, the fire, fire engine fire lights, lights on. Wow. <laughs> Shoot a fish with it or a frog. Let's see if I'm skilled enough to kill one. <laughs> I think it's gonna be really hard, but I might as well try. It's even got a little reel on it. Show the reel. Mini reel. Very cool. <laughs> Can't get better than this. <laughs> so you shoot it and then you reel it back in? Yeah, like a rod. All right, we'll see if you can do it. Can he do it? Can he do it or can he not do it? <laughs> We're gonna find out. Alright guys, time to look for some frogs. Alright guys, so far it's tied, 
Yeah, me Denver. and Mitsuki. Baby alligator. Look at him. He's so cute. Not to shoot it in the head so I don't lose the, the, the arrows, the darts. It's a nice one. Yeah. I'm happy. Crazy, this is so fun. <laughs> it's like spear fishing but with a blow dart. <laughs> Oh, I think he did. Did you get it? 
get it? There it is. We got oh. a winner. <laughs> Sniper. Sniper. I think I'm officially a frog hunter. <laughs> frog dart hunter. Yeah, you got that. Yeah! Woo! So the frog legs, what yeah. did you marinate them in? I marinate them in ginger, grated ginger, garlic, soy sauce, marine, uh, sesame chili oil. Mm -hmm. I think pretty much it, but very, very simple. How long did you marinate it for? For a whole day. So 24 hours? Yeah, as long as you marinate for overnight, it should be good enough. All right. We're going to take it out to a bowl. All of it. You don't have to salt these guys anymore because it's been already salted. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mmm, it smells so good. And then I would use a lot of cornstarch. Okay. Or potato starch. If you have potato starch, that would be better. Potato starch is better? Yeah. It stays crispier. Oh, okay. Also being fried. Just a little bit. And I'm gonna fry this thing in oil. Yeah. And the oil has to be at least 380 degrees. It's amazing. All right, try oh, it. Give it to me. Yes. <laughs> try it. Yeah, let me Dig try in. it. Do you want me to put some lemon on it? Well, maybe without it first. Mm. Is it good? Mm. Yeah? It's delicious. Holy shit, this is good. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. -hmm. This is amazing. Yeah? This is good. Alright, I'm gonna try it. Whoa! We need a bone container. Oh my god. Right? Well, amazing. I, I have never cooked frogs. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. Mm. Oh my god, it's so good. Wow, I think it is so tender. I think it tastes better than chicken. People say it's gamey. People say no. It's not gamey at all. I think it's mm -mm. cookie, right? And then it's probably oh my a God. pretty good food. Delicious. Okay, guys, I'm gonna sit down mm -hmm. and dig in. Dig in. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> guys, we killed it. We ate all of it. <laughs> and you thought you made too much? No, I <laughs> I thought that I was making too much. Like I heard people about this and we didn't like the frogs. <laughs> But it was not enough, probably. Gone. We smashed it. Five minutes. Gone. Suki's plate, my plate, Jose's plate, only bones. Oh, bones. Only bones. All right, guys, well, this is going to end our video. Thank you so much for coming along with us. I hope you had fun with me, Mitsuki, and Jose. Mm. If you had a good time, please subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you on the next one. <laughs>